Hey guys, it's Jason Residlo reporting from the Las Vegas Convention Center for CES 2025. Come along with me as I explore the latest in vehicle technology. Chinese automaker Zeker brought three new vehicles to CES. We're going to highlight two of them. The 001 FR is an electric shooting brake with a 100 kilowatt per hour battery offering a range of up to 435 miles. The 009 Grand is a four-seat luxury minivan with a 108 kilowatt per hour battery and a high-performance silicon carbide electric drive system. Kubota showed off several new solutions for residential, agriculture, and construction sites. First, the Agri Concept 2.0 is an electric tractor concept offering data, AI, automation, and electrification as a choice of powertrain for when you want to drive and autonomous when you don't. It's a fully autonomous uh, small tractor that uh, also allows folks to enjoy driving it if they want to. It's got a cab that lifts up, so if, if you're in a situation where you need to jump on the tractor and drive it, we, we still give folks that option. We know that uh, we're not going to be able to just get to full autonomy in one leap. Um, we're going to need humans in the loop for a while. And there's uh, folks like me that enjoy driving a tractor. And to be able to have that optionality of maybe it's the springtime and it's a nice perfect day and I want to go mow, maybe I want to do that. But if it's a hot middle of you know, Texas where I live, uh, maybe I don't want to do it that day. Maybe I want to send the tractor to do it by itself. I have that option with this uh, platform that we have. There's an easy to use flexibility controlled by remote or the onboard joystick with near future iterations offering completely autonomous operation, making the user experience as enjoyable as the KATR is effective. Next, the KATR is a four-wheeled, all-terrain, multi-function robot. The KATR maintains a level cargo deck when working on uneven terrain and can work autonomously or remotely to tackle a range of versatile applications in agriculture and construction environments. And on the top here, you can see we've got our um, plant health imager. And this imager can be swapped on and off with different implements or tools depending on what your task is that you're needing done. And this particular one has advanced cameras and images, uh, imaging systems. They're looking for plant health. They can look at um, near infrared and infrared wavelengths. And um, there's certain types of plant anomalies that are not going to be uh, present to the human eye, but uh, a camera can see them readily. And with machine learning technology, we can uh, give growers the advanced warning they need to take care of those issues uh, right away. Hyundai Mobis introduced its all-new full windshield holographic display. It features a panoramic projection of various driving information, navigation and infotainment data across the vehicle's front windshield. Oshkosh showed off its new electrification, AI, autonomy, and connectivity solutions for everyday heroes. First, Oshkosh introduced its collision avoidance mitigation system for first responders. It uses sensors and radar to detect the speed and proximity of oncoming vehicles. Secondly, this new Oshkosh driverless cargo handler will transport baggage between designated locations on the airport ramp. This is our future of where the baggage tractors are going to go. So current, it's a current project that's being worked on right now. Proof of concept will be this year. We, this is fully electric. So this is point of use. So for 90% of our customers, that are taking product from the aircraft to the sort facility or sort facility of the aircraft, this has that ability to fit that need instead of having an operator do those long distance drives from the sort facility out to the aircraft, they could reassign those people to other more important tasks and have this do that drive for them. The first vehicle is gonna be built in 2025 
We're looking for a key customer agreement later this year, early 26, once we have the basic development part of this done. Finally, the Oshkosh Harry is an autonomous robot designed for on-demand garbage collection to help manage your weekly chores. It works alongside your smartphone app or virtual at-home assistant. And what Harry will do is, uh, is will come to your doorstep, collect your refuse, and bring it back out. So much like you would order an Uber, you get your phone app, you click on the app, you call Harry out when, you're, uh, when you have some trash that you want to throw away, and Harry will come to you. So in this simulation, Harry is coming at my, my doorstep. Uh, if I throw some uh, my, my refuse inside there or my recycling, uh, I'm ready. I push the button saying that I'm ready for it to go. Uh, Harry will close and it will then take it away uh, to the, the dump site of your community. So Harry shows off uh, Oshkosh's expertise in autonomous capability and electrification. And also uh, will learn uh, different areas uh, of a planned community. It'll see what roads it goes to. It learns and gets better uh, over time. So uh, this is Harry. Suzuki partnered with Applied EV to develop a safe, simple, small car-sized autonomous electric platform that specializes in work mobility. Also, their versatile micro e-mobility platform concept applies the electric wheelchair technology that Suzuki has cultivated over the years to provide the undercarriage of various robots. Brunswick displayed a 40-foot Boston Whaler 405 Conquest to show off its latest development version of its autonomous docking system. The motion platform is the beating heart of Pixel Akira, designed to host vehicles of any size and simulate nearly any driving condition. Compact yet powerful, this stage provides six degrees of motion and unlimited rotational yaw, enabling precise replication of real-world dynamics. Whether you're capturing the smooth lines of a race car hugging a sharp corner or the chaotic spirals of a helicopter in distress, Pixel Akira's capabilities are unmatched. It can articulate up to 130 degrees per second allowing for high-speed spins, crash simulations, or delicate tilts with absolute accuracy. Stay with America JR for more coverage from CES 2025. Reporting from the Las Vegas Convention Center, I'm Jason Residlo for AmericaJR.com.